Welcome to Time Beat Breaking News Channel. Here are our breaking news today. 1. Arclight Cinemas, Pacific Theaters will close permanently. 2. Nick's Beat Raptor, 102, 96. The United States. Arclight Cinemas, Pacific Theaters will close permanently. Arclight Cinemas and Pacific Theaters will close down, a victim of a global pandemic that brought moviegoing to a standstill. The news comes as things begin to look up for the hard-hit exhibition industry and serves as a reminder of the economic devastation wrought by a public health crisis that upended cultural life. After shutting our doors more than a year ago, today we must share the difficult and sad news that Pacific will not be reopening its Arclight Cinemas and Pacific Theaters locations, the company said in a statement. This was not the outcome anyone wanted, but despite a huge effort that exhausted all potential options, the company does not have a viable way forward. The closure means that some of the most prominent and popular movie theaters in the heart of the film industry will be shuttered, including the iconic Cinerama Dome, which has hosted movie premieres and had cameos in everything from Melrose Place to Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. The announcement resulted in paroxysms of grief across social media, as cinephiles, actors, and filmmakers like Gina prince bythewood Barry Jenkins and Elijah would wade in on Twitter and other platforms to express their dismay that these marquees may remain dark even after COVID-19 abates. Next Beat Raptor, 102. 96. The Knicks have fought their way back to an even record, 27-27, with a much-needed win last night at the Garden defeating the Toronto Raptors, 102. 96. The play of R.J. Barrett has been almost superstar status at times, making clutch shots behind the arc, driving to the basket, drawing fouls, and making his free throws at the line. Barrett's improvement over last year is extremely notable, and at 20 years old, the youngest player on the Knicks roster, he is becoming an all-star in this league. One of three big reasons for their three-point stats is Julius Randle who has become the assists leader on the team, the big man draws in the defense, demanding double coverage, and then kicks it out to the open man, many times one of his favorite targets, Reggie Bullock. The Knicks' three-point shooting has been much improved, up until last night they were seventh in the league from three-point range. The Knicks are currently in the 8th spot in the Eastern Conference, and only two games separate them from the four other teams above them, Celtics, Hornets, Heat and Hawks. Thank you for watching, we help you stay up to date all the news hourly, please subscribe our channel to follow up the latest one.